Hey, it's your girl Noelle Nettles on the build up. Um, I'm coming to you all today about a situation that really, really rubbed me wrong. And so I said, you know what? Let me go to the build up crew, let them know what happened. So here at the Nettles house, aka the Nettles compound, aka the Nettles trustee camp. By that I mean I, Noelle. I'm the warden. I run a tight ship. I am also the cook. I am also the person who facilitates, you know, lockdown time. I do all that. So I have trustee number three, who is Dwight, aka Trey. I have trustee number four, Davion. So I tell them when I get them up in the morning, hey, do not, I repeat, do not bring any fundraisers to the house. Okay, cool. So understood. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Everybody go to school. Well, then inmate number three, a.k.a. trustee number three, a.k.a. Dwight, a.k.a. Trey decides he gonna go to school. His teacher gonna give him one of these. What they say? Fundraising. Excuse me, sir. Didn't I already tell you we don't take fundraisers at the Nettles compound? You don't get it? Okay. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry. She gave it to me. Okay. Well, just let your teacher know. This mother does not do fundraisers. Yes, ma'am. So he come back two days later. What is that? Two fundraiser packages. Trustee number three. Let me sit up for you. Because what you're not going to do is play me like I didn't tell you that from day one. I don't do fundraisers. You caught me slipping with the popcorn because you know I like popcorn. Let me tell you this, trustee number three. Your all listen, all of your commissary privileges will be revoked. You bring one more fundraiser to my house. Oh, you think I'm playing? Don't go in my pantry, aka the commissary, and get no Debbie snacks, no chips, no pickles, no cookies, no nothing. Summer sausage and cheese, none of it. No crackers, no nothing. Oatmeal, none of it. I'm not playing with you. You will get up earlier. And then you keep on playing with me. I'm going to send you to solitary confinement. And then your daylight will go out faster than your nighttime. You understand? By that, I mean, you will go on lockdown early and earlier. Every single time you bring a fundraiser to my house. So then to make it even more, more detrimental to him. I tell in MA number four, trustee number four, Davion, hey, you better talk to trustee number three because if he bring any more contraband in my house, you're going to be in solitary confinement with him. Why? Because that's your brother. So I suggest y'all have a little powwow because I'm going to stop letting you go outside to the yard playing basketball with the other inmates from the other compounds. You understand? You think I'm playing? You're going to be out here in the yard doing push-ups. That's what's going to happen. Lifting weights. We ain't going to do no more basketball time. So I suggest trustee number three and trustee number four go back and talk to the schoolhouse and let them know. The warden at the Nettles compound is not playing anymore about these fundraisers. So next time you decide to send trustee number three home with a fundraiser, trustee number four will be affected by this for bringing contraband in my house and he will not get any playtime in the yard. So going forward, school districts and teachers, you have parents like me, a.k.a. the wardens of the house who don't do fundraisers. So next time you decide to send trustee number three home with a fundraiser, know you are at fault for why he's on lockdown.